Let's give this a try. A tan to the power of 4x integral. How can we do it? Think about this identity. Tan square x plus 1 is equal to secant square x. Then we can say tan square is equal to secant square x minus 1. We will separate everything here into two separate items. Eventually, tan square x times tan square x, the product of these, will give you what you have over here. You can bring this right over here. I'm looking here at a tan square x then times a secant square x minus 1 dx distribute and separate across that negative we will have here a tan square x secant square x minus you'll have here a tan square x dx you know here's a dx focus right over here u substitution if u was equal to tan x you know you can easily do this it'll be taking you through to completion for this part right here du is equal to secant square x dx and then you know dx here is going to be equal to du over secant square x. Bring in these substitutions. You'll see you'll have a u square. This will cancel out with that. You'll have a u square du. When you take this to completion and resubstitute the u, you'll have here a tan cube x over 3 come from here. Now I have to focus over here. You know tan square x again is equal to what? It's equal to, you have this minusing out, secant square x minus 1 dx. Separate everything across into two independent integrals across the minus with the effect of this minus. I'm looking at a minus integral secant square x dx. Then I'm looking at a plus integral dx. From here I'll have a plus x plus c. This c is coming from your entirety of your integration procedure. I'm just bringing it out from here. From here you know you have an antiderivative. If the derivative of tan x is secant square x, then the antiderivative must be tan x. I have a minus tan x. When I combine all of these, your antiderivative comes through. You're looking here at a tan cube x over 3 minus tan x plus x plus c. All of these represent your antiderivative for your original integrand, which was tan to the 4x. Again, your end result is tan cube x over 3 minus tan x plus x plus c, and we are done.